And then when it comes to food, then food is generally categorized into two different types, and that is uh, animal-based food and non-animal-based food. Animals are two types, land-based or sea-based. With, re with regards to sea animals, yeah, any fish and the likes, then every type of... Kif, are you studying? No, I'm not. Uh, every type of animal which is in the sea, the, it is halal. Whether it comes out alive or dead, it is halal. Uh, even if the animal which is in the sea it's named with a name which is similar to one upon the land which is haram it is still permitted like for example the eel which is like a snake but because it is in the water in the sea it's permitted now as for land animals so from the animals every animal which is a predator now 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 no. So, which contains, I think, the incisors, the teeth, and canines. No. Any predator, like, for example, dogs and lions and uh, tigers and such, all of them are haram. And also, any bird which has claws, <laughs> like eagles, and who is an eagle or falcon? The No. والغراب نعم and crows نعم uh, because they have claws then they are haram and of course swine pigs and also domesticated donkeys and insects and that which lives off impurities eats impurities even if we possessed a chicken and you notice from this chicken that it is only feeding off impurities then this chicken would be isolated or caged until it is only eating from that which is good and pure, and then it is returned.